Okay, so this this next book uh, recommendation is actually pretty fun. Um, it goes along with uh, one of the other ones that I did. It's the Stylish Academic Writing by Helen Sword. Um, this one is another one. It it it's, can be applied to academic writing as well as professional writing. Uh, this book I've had. This is my, this is my third personal copy of it. Um, my first one was lost. My second one, I marked it all up, and I put my nice tabs on it, and it was stolen. Uh, somebody stole my book bag full of books. So hopefully, it was literally a book bag full of books. I carry around six or seven books with me uh, uh, everywhere I go. Um, I'm one of those guys. Um, but they stole my book bag, so now they had it. So I had to buy a new copy. It's a fresh copy, and it's called The Sense of Style by Steven Pinker. He is one of my favorite authors. He writes a whole bunch of uh, different books, uh, even unrelated to writing. Uh, but he is an exceptional exceptional writer, um, and he's definitely one of my, my top authors, my author choices. This is also one of my top picks for... Um, master's program uh, students that they need to get this. So I typically recommend this one, Struck in Whites, and then Stylish Academic Writing along with whatever st- manual um, that your your college recommends, either Chicago or APA. Um, along, if you combine all the information in those books, your writing is going to be significantly better. Now, the sense of style um, goes over. Let me go over some some of the chapters really quick so you can kind of get an overview of it so if you find it at your thrift store buy it chapter one is good writing chapter two a window into the world of writing Um, chapter three is the curse of knowledge this is why academic writing is so crappy to read and so frustrating to read is because of the curse of knowledge the more you know the more you forget to explain in your writing and it makes it uh, that much harder to understand the world of professional writing and technical writing also has the curse of knowledge and this teaches you how to step back to make sure you're not um, missing those steps uh, chapter four is the web the tree and the string chapter five is arcs of co- coherence a lot of uh, parallelism remember your sentences need to flow they need to match and they need to be smooth right smooth smooth um and chapter six is telling right from wrong it's a very simple book um it's actually for me it was more of a reference book so you read it um look at how awesome this is they even give you the the old diagrams on it uh where you could break down noun phrases into article noun and clauses trust me it sounds like it's a bunch of hoopla um and i'm never going to use it but if you have time uh i would recommend Definitely recommend Steven Pinker's The Sense of Style. Use it as a reference guide, not just a book. Uh, use the little tabs and highlight highlight this this bad boy um, because this with the stylish academic writing by Helen Sword along with whatever manual of style um, your college uh, requires is going to set, set you up for success, and I guarantee it uh, all the book recommendations that i'm making i have used extensively um, and these are all the ones that i would recommend even if you want to get into professional writing outside of the university you could use every book that i recommend inside and outside um, that's why i recommend these specific ones instead of apa manual of style Um, I hope this video helped. Once again, if you have any questions or if you want me to post any more videos, just let me know. And I am more than happy to.